guys welcome back to another video and of course this lighting sucks let me let me retry that welcome back to my channel and of course jack you are an attention w-h-o-r-e yeah you i randomly decided to pick up the vlog camera and vlog this weekend it's currently friday 6 45 my sister is driving up from charleston she lives in charleston and she's gonna be here for the weekend so i'm super excited to see her i still have like the whole apartment to clean up these are the things that i like save for the weekend i like save all the cleaning for like saturday morning so yeah i was not able to clean up the place like really at all this week so i have laundry everywhere dishes in the sink bed has not been made i had work all day and then i worked out and then gave Jax a bath which is never fun he literally is the world's worst bath taker yeah i'm talking about you he's like who me what yeah you i'm kidding he's fine yeah, i think he, he could definitely be worse i'm about to take like a quick body shower because i am sweaty and then i think we're gonna walk up to the battery for dinner if you've ever been to atlanta like you probably know where the battery is it's like where the brave stadium is and they built this like basically shopping eating district like literally connected to the stadium and so there's a bunch of like really good restaurants and then they also have like shopping they have a yoga studio they have like a nail place it's just kind of like a little district so it's really fun living by there but yeah she is almost here so i'm going to try to knock out 10 things in 10 minutes but yeah just wanted to start off the vlog and let's have a weekend okay she just got here but she's locked out so i'm gonna go get her <laughs> Woo! Hi. jax is gonna be standing on his head <gasps> yeah hi buddy oh are you bringing her your toy that's sweet he always likes to bring you something, like when you walk in the door. I love it. Can you bring me a margarita? I don't think he's quite there yet. Okay, just threw on an outfit, did some quick makeup. I think the bodysuit is from Abercrombie. Jeans are a Goldie from Revolve. And then shoes are Jordans. Also, I'm in my guest room, and it's literally... Don't even look at that. It's a disaster right now. I'm just like in the process of changing some things in here because I have a lot of people staying with me this upcoming month. It's like every weekend someone new is staying with me. So I want this to be a little updated, a little refreshed. I think we're, do you just wanna drive up there? <laughs> I kind of am feeling lazy. I took Jax on a walk to the battery earlier today, so I'm like really not feeling like walking. Jax has like anxiety that there's someone else here. I think he's just so used wow. to it just being Where's us two. Alex? He is so social though. He loves people and I love that about him. Oh, he's so Hello. sweet. I love that he's clean too now. You clean. I need to brush you out though. That's for a later time though. But I don't think you realize how big you are. Like, you're pretty big. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I am so tired. Oh man, it is 7.09. We are about to get ready to go to Pilates at 8.05. I slept like a freaking rock last night, did you? Like, I don't think I moved one time in my sleep. Also, not us wearing the same PJs. <laughs> All right, we're ready to go. Ready to go kick Stormy's butt. Just kidding. All right, I'm gonna, do you want pre-workout or anything? Do you usually take pre-workout? No, so I, I usually take BCAs and L-glutamine and like drink it during and after class. Jax. Okay. Do you want that? Some, yeah. I just got the amino wane pre-workout. And of course, as soon as I order it, Alex comes out, Alex Earl comes out with her new flavor. That looks really good. Berry elixir. But apparently it sold out like in less than a day. Yeah. I haven't even tried this one yet though. The pink lemonade. But I like that it's clean ingredients and apparently doesn't make you feel like jittery. Which I like. Hey. Okay, so right now I'm making my concoction of BCAs and L-glutamine. BCAs help with, or BCAAs help with like muscle recovery and probably some other things, but that's like the main thing. I get the Extend brand and I get the Kiwi Strawberry and it's pretty good. I've tried the Alani New BCAs and they're pretty good. They're just expensive. Oh, and it also has electrolytes. 
so it helps with hydration and all that good stuff. And then L-glutamine helps repair your gut lining if you have like a leaky gut, <laughs> which I don't think that I do, but it just really helps with down there digestion and all of that. I don't know. It's also just like good to supplement L-glutamine more into your diet because you don't get enough through your food. And then I'll mix it up. I usually do this in a blender bottle, but all of mine are dirty right now. Bada boom, bada bang. Looks like a little cocktail. <laughs> okay. <Yeah>. Cheers. <laughs> all right, we've got to go. shaking i would go again she was like a good instructor too i'm kind of mad though because it was supposed to be buns and guns there wasn't a lot of buns yeah it was, was basically inner thighs. inner thighs a little bit of hamstrings and then it was back so like it wasn't even arms i feel like because i usually love their buns and guns classes because they're literally all glutes and all arms which is great and also most classes you also do obliques but today we didn't do obliques we just did center core like i'll be sore tomorrow yeah your inner thighs will definitely be sore but anyways great start to our saturday <laughs> Again, my lady. Thank you. Storm is about to try my sauna. <laughs> I got it like a few months ago, I think. It has a little chair in there. And it, well, it's basically like a steam room because it's like you put water in that little guy and then it steams up. So, and I like move it out to like right here so I can watch TV when I do it. It's really the best thing ever. It's like $160 from Amazon. Alrighty. We just finished breakfast and got dressed. Okay, I'm so mad. I got hair oil on this sweatshirt last week and it won't come out. I tried washing it and it literally won't come out. So I think we're gonna go to Lenox Mall, which is like 15 minutes away in Buckhead. And we're gonna shop around a little bit because we both wanna go to the stores there. We have Noritzia, that's the only Noritzia we have in Atlanta is at Lenox. Stormay wants to go to Sephora, probably go to like Zara. And then I think we wanna get acai bowls for lunch. So yeah, today is also for sure gonna be a hat day because I have not washed my hair since Tuesday and it's Saturday, but we're going to dinner tonight and we wanna like get kind of dressed up and try to look cute. So I think I'm just gonna hold off and wash my hair when we get back. <laughs> I always feel bad leaving him. He's so cute. I'm sorry, you can't go to the mall. <laughs> he always knows when I'm leaving him. Got the goods. <laughs> We are about to smack this around. Ooh. Okay, I got the pitaya blend. Usually I get the acai, like the normal acai, but let's be on brisky and got pitaya. And then granola, strawberries, blueberries, pineapple, almond butter, and then chia seeds. I don't normally get chia seeds, but they're healthy, I think. <laughs> they're good for something, right? What are they good for? Like immunity or something? What'd you get? Share with the class. Regular acai, granola, bananas, pineapple, strawberries. Cow I kind of wish I would have gotten cow nips. I feel like they add a little something, something. They really do. Wow. It was very good. This will be gone in three minutes. On the clock. Okay, we're gonna eat this and then we have the mall for a couple hours and then see where the rest of the day takes us. Isn't our hat cute? Mm. Turn to the side. Aviator Nation. Got this in Vail. Went on a special quest Vail to get early. it. Do they have like an Aviator Nation store in Vail? Yes. Oh, that's cool. They only have like never been to one. Maybe like twenty storefronts. Oh wow! <laughs> Hungry girls. <laughs> Gone. Done and dusted. Okay. Do y'all hear Jax right now? Hey. <laughs> we just got back from the mall. 
We literally shopped until we dropped. I am exhausted. It is three now. About to have a little snack because we've both been craving chips and salsa. But we had a good day shopping. I got stuff from a few different places. So first we're into Abercrombie. Literally like my favorite store. And I have three weddings in May. So I got a dress for one of them. I don't know which one I'll wear this to. Is it cute? I want yeah. pink too. I don't even think it's a midi. I think it's honestly like floor length. So I guess I'll wear it to whichever wedding is like the most formal. And then I got this crew neck sweatshirt. I have it in this color. But I got it in navy too. Because I've really been loving navy lately. Because it's like not as intense as black. And then from Sephora I got... I didn't go crazy, I literally just got one thing because they're having their Sephora savings event in April. So like you get anything for 20% off if you're a Rogue yeah. member. I or I guess, that. what do you mean? That it was coming up. Yeah, April 14th. I mean, that's not soon, but like, I can't be going crazy. You wanna Smile. show what you got too? I bought three things from Sephora. Like, I could have waited. Did y'all hear that? He literally sounds like Chewbacca. He's just so excited. We literally just walked in the door. Dude. But I got the Ordinary Rose Hip Seed Oil for gua shaing because I'm trying to get more consistent with gua shaing because I do see a difference when I use it, like in my face. Your mom is a gua shaer. For sure. And it's best if you use like a facial oil because it just helps like glide better. So that was like $10, so not bad. And then from Forever 21, which I like never really go in there anymore, but we were talking about this. If you like need something specific, like say you need like, I need an orange bodysuit or like a tan I need a white skirt. Dress, or a white purse for tonight and I found that. She found it. I don't think I have any tops like this color. So I thought it was super cute. Just like a, it does go down pretty low. So we'll see how that works. I didn't try it on. I really didn't try anything on except Abercrombie because you know like you just get to a point when you're shopping and you're just so over it. You're like, I'll just buy it and if I don't like it or it doesn't fit, I'll just return it. And that's the point you reach clearly because at Urban, I got two or I got, I got this pair of pants in two different sizes. They didn't have the size in between. So I'm scared one is gonna be really big and then one is gonna be really small. So I like this wash. Jean, it's like a beige, light tan, I don't know. Actually, these are two different shades, aren't they? This is a little darker. We'll see. And then I got this top, or I got two tops, three tops? Two tops, same top, different colors, so whichever one I like better, I'll keep, I guess. I got it in this brown color, super cute. And then I got it in this light blue, like icy blue. Cute for spring. So yeah, that's it, that's all I got. What about you, you got little haul? Here's my mom. Setting spray. Because I'm almost out. What kind? Charlotte Tilbury? Charlotte Tilbury. That's the best. Well, I haven't used this one. You said I used it. Really? I like it. Yeah. I like the way it smells too. I got a liner brush because I'm going to try and do. Eyeliner? Eyeliner. <laughs> and then highlighter. I've never seen that. I haven't either. It's is it liquid? It's a, yeah, it's roll on liquid. The one I'm using right now is Becca Backlight, and I think they discontinued it. And then I got this purse specifically for the dress that I'm wearing tonight. And then these shorts to throw on when I'm at the beach. So, woo! Yeah, there's my haul. What a haul, Jackson! What did you get from the mall? Oh. Say, mom didn't get me anything. How oh, rude! <laughs> yeah, we're about to grab on some chips and salsa. We've literally been talking about these, having these chips and salsa for the past like three hours. We'll munch on those, and then I think we're gonna take showers, wash our hair because we've been rocking the hat all day. Yeah. Oh, we got told we were Cali Beach girls today. So. Oh yeah, we were in line at Starbucks because we, you know, we need a little something. And the girl at the checkout was, what did she say? As soon as we walked up, she's like, y'all are giving me beachy California girls. <laughs> I guess because we were like, just wearing hats and had blonde hair, I don't know. And I was like, that's such a compliment. And I was like, she actually lives at the beach because Stormay lives in Charleston. But, like, I don't, I wish I did. We love nice workers, like nice, nice checkout people. They're hard to come by these days. But anyways, we're gonna take showers. I'm probably gonna play with Jacks like outside a little bit, throw the frisbee around, and then we'll start getting ready for dinner. So we did something a little crazy. <laughs> a little impulsive, if you will. I literally just got out of the shower and I was walking Jacks and I was like, you know what, I'm really craving a little something sweet. <laughs> So I got crumple cookies delivered. Mm -hmm. So they just opened one like pretty close, like in Sandy Springs. It's like 15 minutes away. Oh my God, that looks so good. Oh my God, oh, looks wow. so good. So it's raspberry cheesecake, Texas sheet cake, I think, monster cookie, and then toffee, chocolate toffee or something like that. We do a little taste test. Which one are you gonna try first? Oh my God, that one looks so warm. This one is like literally falling apart. Mm. 
Okay, so this is the toffee. Is it good? Oh my god. <gasps> oh my god. Uh -huh. Wow. That was incredible. That was so good. <laughs> That's like one of my favorite ever. I'm not just happy monster. I'm, my, like, I'm a monster ever. cookie girl. Oh, this one's warm too. It's like warm. Oh, apart. heck yeah. He literally came so fast too, the delivery driver. And he came all the way to my door. No delivery person has ever done that. They usually call me when they're outside and like stay in the car and make me go all the way down. So which is fine. Cause like if I'm lazy enough to like order something, like I should be able to walk down, you know? Yeah. He came all the way to my door. I'm like, oh, that is so sweet. Wow. Mmm. Don't mind the towel on my head. All right. Strawberry or raspberry cheesecake, whichever one this is. Oh, it's chilled. It's a cold cookie. <laughs> How is it? Very good. I hope the sound of our chewing isn't repulsive. Mm. I like that it's cold. Well, I guess it would be weird warm. Like, warm cheesecake would be freaking weird. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Favorite so far? First one. Mm -hmm. I don't know. That one and the monster are pretty neck and neck. They're all They're amazing. They're all amazing, yeah. But if you like have to choose, yeah. If I had to choose, it's still the first one. Okay. I don't know about this Texas sheet cake. This one I'm least excited about. Me too. I almost got the sugar cookie. Oh, the OG. Oh, should I have gotten that? I've never tried the sugar cookie. What? Yeah, I know. Isn't that crazy? That one's really good. You should have gotten that one. I should have gotten that one. Oh, well. But I was like, we need to try all the flavors of the week. Sugar cookie will always be there. These are walnuts. I don't know about that. Oh yeah, I don't like that one. No, it's not favorite. rich. No, I like a good rich cookie. I gotta go back. Mm -hmm. Shouldn't show her you. I know, dang it. Oh well, I'm so glad. Just what we needed. It's 4, 13 now. We just our showers, obviously. I like have to let my hair, or I can't put my hair up in a towel anymore because I got hair extensions. Oh my gosh, look at my <laughs> hair was sopping wet. But when I saw that the delivery dryer was almost here, I literally got out of the shower and didn't even like towel dry my hair at all. So. so now we're just gonna be munching on these, I guess, all night into tomorrow. Whoops. Mm -mm -mm. Changed hair, makeup, all the things. I just need to put on some lipstick. Also, this is the setup for my makeup because I'm still trying to figure out this guest room's just a mess right now. So I usually do my makeup there, but the lighting obviously sucks there. So I moved this mirror. I don't even know where this was from and just did it in front of there. And it was so much better. Like the lighting is immaculate right there, but obviously I can't sit on the floor every time I do my makeup. I mean, I guess I could, but this is like really supposed to be the guest room or Jaxie's room, Jaxie's lair. So yeah, it worked for today. I think I'm gonna do some lipstick. I don't know what color. I might just do like my normal lip combo. I'm trying to get good at winged eyeliner. And I feel like I'm getting a little bit better. I just use dark eyeshadow. I don't use like a black eyeliner because I feel like black on me is just too harsh. So I've been using like a dark brown. I really like it. I think Anastasia has the best lip liner. It just goes on so smooth. I don't know. And we're gonna use Charlotte Tilbury, Kim KW, classic. Okay, I got this new Fenty lip gloss the other week. Actually, I think I got it a while back, and I really like it. But yeah, that's the finished look. This is Jaxie's finished look. Show them your beat. <laughs> he makes leaving so hard. Like, he's so perfect. He does no wrong. Like, what did I do to deserve him? Nothing. We don't deserve dogs in general. I wish I could kiss you, but I have lipstick on. Oh, what? Okay, I think we're ready to go. You ready, Stormy? Yeah. Okay. Oh, your tag is still on for sure. Oh, crap. We're finally leaving four hours later. We're going to Barcelona in West Midtown. It's like one of my favorite places to bring people that have never been to Atlanta. I feel like it's a good, like, I just especially requested this. Yeah, she's been here before and she loved it and wants to go back. So if that's not a testament, it's like a tapas and like wine bar kind of vibe, but it's really good atmosphere. They have like an indoor area and then like an outdoor patio with like a fireplace and heaters and it's just a vibe. I actually took my friends from college there when they visited me and they loved it. They have good sangria, obviously good wine, really good patatas bravas, as I say it, or potatoes, yeah. something like that. They have like steak, lamb, hummus, just like anything you can think of. It's really good. We're at this cool little rooftop called LOA. Leave of absence. And we got these drinks. What was this called? THD? D. And it was like tequila, hibiscus, limoncello. Is that what it was? And it's so cutie. Keeps 
coming. <laughs> Prayers. Like, we can't even finish what we have in front of us. That was our appetizer, we couldn't finish it. He gave us more bread. Like, we're dying. Well, we just walked up on a wrestling match. I think we should join. <laughs> Do you imagine? Who would win in a fight? You think you would? Probably, yeah. Uh, <laughs> that's what I thought. Wait, this has to be staged, right? Oh, it's oh, it's for sure staged. Okay, but like, what is going on? Why are there so many people in there? Just another night in Atlanta. Good morning, it's the next day. It is like, is it 10.30? It's 10.30. We slept in a little bit. And that's okay, that's what the weekends are for. But we're about to go to brunch at Hobnob in Atlantic Station and they have like shops and stuff like in the area. So I think we're gonna go try to get a table and then like maybe walk around. Dinner was so good last night. We just like split a bunch of tapas. We had like potato, patatas bravas. I don't know if I'm saying that right. Calamari, we had their like grilled chicken. They put like some kind of like honey mustard glaze on it, so good. And then we had, oh, we had charcuterie board like while we were waiting. And then we had sangria and yeah, it was really good. Before that, we went to a rooftop called LOA in West Midtown. I think it opened up last summer. So it's still pre fairly new and it was a vibe. The drinks were very expensive though. Our drinks together with tip was like, how much were our drinks? Like 40 something dollars? <laughs> it's like $47 for two drinks. And they were good, but like they were not worth $47. I guess that's the price you pay for good vibes. But yeah, it was good weather last night and then it rained this morning when I was taking Jax out. I think we're about to make some coffee before we go because I don't think Hobnob has like good coffee. Because <laughs> it's just like a sports bar, like tavern type of thing. So I worked at a sports bra. Sports bra. I worked at a sports bar in college and like our coffee was doo doo. So we're gonna make our own coffee. Also, <laughs> Somebody left their shoe on the ground last night and Jack's got a hold of it. He's never chewed up any of our shoes. Cause one, we don't leave them on the ground because we're scared that he will. And yep, sure enough, point proven he will. I told her I didn't like these shoes though and she needed to get rid of them anyways. I think it was on purpose. I think they're schemes. No, no. I think I might have a little bite of crumble cookie as an appetizer. Oh, I forgot about that. I know, I forgot we had these too. Let's see how much is even left. <laughs> Just remnants. We did not like the Texas sheet cake. Sorry if that's your favorite, but. It shouldn't be.